Over my right shoulder is Bishop Peak Hiking Trail, the famous hiking trail in San Luis Obispo County. Now imagine hiking up and down this trail, not once, not twice, but three times all in the same day. That seems nearly impossible and incredibly tiring. Now imagine doing that also with a prosthetic leg. That does seem impossible, but nothing is impossible for Paso Robles resident Bill Malzin. Yeah. That's me. Bill Malzin's life changed drastically when he was 19 years old. 1971, I was in the Marine Corps, but I got run over by a drunk driver. Got caught between the bumpers of uh, two cars and smashed my leg off. Ended up being an amputee in October 1971. Malzin would pick himself up following the accident, working in pipe welding for 40 years and in the oil refineries for eight years, all with a wooden leg. I used to tinker with my dad's legs when I was a kid and get in trouble if I didn't know how to put it back together. And now I get paid to do it. His older son Zach is now a certified prosthetist. He never complained and never let it slow him down. So I thought it would be nice to be able to help people achieve the same thing. He custom made a computerized prosthetic, changing Bill's outlook on retirement. Retired, decided uh, I should do something besides hang out. After watching Hugh Hauser of California's Gold climb the Half Dome at Yosemite, Bill decided to do the same. When I've made up my mind that I'm going to do something, I, I do my best to do it. My father's my hero because every day he's shown the dedication and drive to get up, go to work, and be there for us. Bill's youngest son, Jeremiah, agreed to train with him for the hike. To simulate, you had to be able to hike up and down Bishop's Peak three times. And then in 2021, uh, I felt I was in good enough shape to go climb Half Dome. In three days, the two climbed all 24 miles. Glad I did, I only fell down about four times on the hike, and that was more from my feet slipping out from under me, falling down. Proving that even the highest heights can be reached, regardless of obvious adversity. When he said he wanted to do it, I had no doubt in my mind that he was going to do it. Every time that my father passed another climber that was complaining or having a difficult time, everybody stopped and everybody said the same message. I can't complain anymore. Look at what he's doing. Just get up, do your job. And both of my sons get up and do their job. While Malzin has already hiked the Half Dome once, he's not satisfied yet. And at the ripe age of 69 years old, he's planning to prepare to train once again to hike it with the sun a second time. Reporting in San Luis Obispo, Dusty Baker, KSBY News.